on that start line, you know, it's very lonely. You're out there on your own and, you know, thoughts go through your mind, oh, what am I doing? But, you know, when you get that gold medal, it's, a, you know, then that's, that's really, you know why you do it, all that hard training for that medal. To win two gold medals, as you say, on an Olympic course, um, that, for me, will certainly go down in uh, one of those top top uh, achievements for me. Um, it's a, a year of really hard hard graft, um, but I am so pleased, so pleased. I put in the hard work um, and I enjoy, when I'm training, I really, really enjoy it. Um, racing is hard work. It, afterwards, it's such an amazing feeling, but I mean, if you ask me that 10 minutes beforehand in the race, I'd say, oh, God, I don't know why I do it. Um, but I just love the, the challenge and just pushing myself um, but, and just, just doing my best, really. And um, what will you do from now until Rio to make sure you can win another medal? Uh, um, work on my technique, work on my starts and um, keep training and keep enjoying. I mean, you know, I've got my coach, John Griffiths, to thank a lot of, well, hugely, and he makes every day a real pleasure. Um, I've got the support of my family, so without them, and that, you know, the thing is, people just see you race, they don't realise what goes on in the background, and if I didn't have that background support, there's no way I'd be here today. An historic gold medalist! The movement is everybody out there in the world.